Now, a perception by consumers that locally made products are inferior to imported ones is fueling the love for substandard drugs according to anti-counterfeit authority ACA. As Flora Limuki reports, pharmaceuticals products remain to be the most counterfeited products in the country. In recent months, counterfeit and substandard goods have flooded the Kenyan market, posing an unfair competition to the genuine products. The most counterfeited products are antibiotics and painkillers. This is according to anti-counterfeit authority. Counterfeiters target the first uh, move in consumer goods. And of course, this includes also medicines. Because if we look at medicines, for example, um, Medicine is, uh, is, is a product that uh, can, be, can be very profitable. Uh, you can bring in a small quantity of medicines and you make a lot of money. You know, people sometimes they can hide it in maybe in their, in, their, in, their, in, their, in their bags. You know, it's very easy to really to conceal uh, counterfeit uh, and even some standard medicine. So that's why you find that uh, counterfeiters would go for it, especially if it is a painkillers, you know, the mostly commonly used uh, medicines, they would go for it. Coupled with corruption and consumer ignorance, counterfeit drugs have seen consumer health put at risk while manufacturers count losses. According to the Anti-Counterfeit Authority, illicit trade remains to be a big challenge towards the attainment of 15% GDP contribution by the manufacturing sector, with the country losing close to 1 trillion Kenyan shillings annually to counterfeit goods. The volume of illicit uh, goods was 726 billion Kenyan shillings in the year 2017, and it increased to 826 billion Kenyan shillings in the year 2018 an increase of 100 billion just in just one year. On the, uh, on, the, on the statistics that we have, we find that counterfeiting constitutes around 10%, around 9% of, um, of the total illicit uh, uh, goods. The Kenya Bureau of Standards, KEBS, is backing a multi-sectoral approach to minimize illicit trade. Okay, here, here in KEBS, we have a two-prone process in terms of the, of the quality assurance of the, of the products that are in the market. One is the product certification. In the product certification, we have uh, the issue of certification of the product eh, at the factory level, where now officers go to the factory premises, they collect samples of those products, and they are brought to KEBS for testing to check whether they're in conformity to the relevant uh, Kenya standard. Trade in counterfeit and substandard goods remains to be a major challenge. In <laughs>